Hi, good evening everyone. My name is Pastor Charles Williams. I'm the founder and the creator of the concept known all over the world today as the Amber Alert uh, System. I am coming to you here tonight um, on behalf of the Connecticut State Police. We currently have an Amber Alert in effect uh, for the city and for the state of Connecticut, the city of Simsbury, that's S-I-M-S-B-U-R-Y, uh, Connecticut. This, is, this Amber Alert is for a three-year-old Anthony Bunce, B-U-N-C-E, and his mother, 40-year-old Yolanda Bunce, B-U-N-C-E, spelling of the last name. Yolanda is five foot one uh, with brown hair and brown eyes. Uh, her and the child was last seen in the Hartford, Connecticut area, uh, and uh, everyone is really, really concerned because she has this three-year-old child, which is hers, uh, with her, but Yolanda suffers with a bipolar disorder, okay? So uh, the uh, Hartford State Police have issued an Amber Alert uh, for, uh, for the two of them. If you know of the whereabouts of them, you're asked to contact uh, 911 uh, in the uh, Connecticut area. And if you're out of the Connecticut area, uh, contact 911 and let them know that you are responding to an Amber Alert in, Sil in uh, Simsbury, uh, Connecticut. Again, uh, this is an active Amber Alert for uh, three-year-old Anthony Bunce, B-U-N-C-E, uh, and 40-year-old Yolanda Bunce. Both are missing uh, from the Hartford, Connecticut area. Uh, her and the child were last seen in the Hartford, uh, Connecticut area um, earlier today. Yolanda suffers with a bipolar disorder. Now, here's the important information. It's a more important information, rather. Uh, Yolanda was last seen driving a 2006 Volvo, okay? A 2006, authorities and uh, uh, all interested personnel are looking for a 2006 uh, Volvo, which is what she was driving earlier today. Uh, however, the, uh, the details did not give me a color of the Volvo or tag number, so we may come back in and update our information uh, as soon as uh, we get updated information. We have been able to confirm through our traffic cameras, okay? Uh, we have been able to confirm through our traffic cameras that the, uh, all of the message boards in Connecticut are now up and they are lit up uh, for this uh, Amber Alert looking for these two uh, subjects of the Amber Alert. Again, uh, I encourage you to use your traffic cam uh, uh, from wherever you are in the United States. Uh, just click on, go into your uh, Hartford, uh, Connecticut area and uh, uh, sit there and, and just kind of begin to scan the, uh, the area. Uh, who knows? You may see something. You may see something that looks out of place. Uh, uh, you, you know, you may be the one that finds, you know, you may be the one that, that uh, has the tip that would uh, lead us to where they are. So uh, we need your help. We need your help. As you know, for the last several days, I've been asking you to, uh, to join in with us in this pilot study program uh, of using traffic cameras in conjunction with Amber Alerts. Uh, and now is the time to do it. Now is the time to do it. If you have not downloaded that app, download that traffic cam video app. Um, and it will allow you to even snap pictures, send them as emails, send them as uh, text messages. As I mean, whatever you see that doesn't look right, you can take a picture of it. So I'm fixing to get out of the way, and I'm going to let you uh, see uh, a picture of the two subjects of the Amber Alert. My name is Pastor Charles Williams. If you have any questions, hit me up on the email at rsprings32 at gmail.com. That's rsprings32 at gmail.com. Now, here is the picture of the subjects that we're looking for in this Amber Alert. Let's see if we can get it up here a little bit better than that. Okay, there we go. Okay, I think we can do this. One and two. I believe we can get it like that. There we go. Okay, so here's what we have here. Uh, this is uh, this is Yolanda. Okay, this is Yolanda. Uh, there on the far, uh, there on the far, it'd be my left, your right. 
that's Yolanda, and then uh, the child is three-year-old Anthony. Uh, both uh, both of are, are um, Caucasian uh, in race, and this is a uh, picture of the car that we are looking for. Okay, a 2006 Volvo. Let me see if I can get uh, get you a better picture of that. There you go. Okay, I'm going to step out of the way here, and uh, here we go. Okay, so this is what we're looking for again. This is an active Amber Alert uh, out of Simsbury, Connecticut, looking for three-year-old Anthony Bunce and 40-year-old Yolanda Bunce. Yolanda is five foot one with brown hair, brown eyes. Uh, her and the child were last seen earlier today around 3.30 in the Hartford, Connecticut area. Yolanda suffers with a bipolar disorder. Folks, we cannot play with this. If you know of anyone in the uh, Hartford, Connecticut area, make them aware. Uh, yeah, make them aware of these uh, uh, of this Amber Alert uh, as well. If you have Facebook friends in the Hartford, Connecticut area, shoot this uh, video over there to them. Like this video, shoot it over there to them, and let them know. Hey, there is an Amber Alert um, in in your city or in your state. Uh, at this present time. And again, I want to encourage you to download that traffic camera app. This is how we were able to confirm that an active Amber Alert is currently going on because all of the message boards and everything uh, have been lit up by the state uh, looking for these two subjects of an Amber Alert. My name is Pastor Charles Williams. Thank you so very much for your support. Hit the like button and send this link around. Let's help bring these two people back home alive and safe. Thanks, God bless you, and I will send an update uh, as it warrants. God bless now. Bye-bye.